Use of Kumalo was a medical mystery. Having gained temporary immunity to the carogenic virus from an experimental drug. Born in 2118 uh, to genetic scientists in Fort Cape, South Africa, Yusuf's family fled to the Robben Island Research Center when their home was overrun by raiders. There, he began training to guard the coastline against attacks. When Robben Island later fell to raiders, Yusuf was extracted by sanctuary forces as a person of interest. He underwent cloning and his clones were distributed to other sanctuaries. There are no records of what became of the original use of Kumalo or if he continues to live through genetic renewal. His title is Metamorph, who, which can mean also something like changing, which could which is hard to explain in this story, in this backstory. It might have another meaning also, which probably is closer to the original. But it's also interesting that it was an experimental drug that gave him a temporary immunity. I think develop, uh, researching into that to make it permanent would have been faster than creating a chimera, but who knows? Who knows? Maybe they couldn't do the same thing. Also interesting to notice that he was uh, trained in combat. The, as he is the guard's uh, advisor, it's just a bit interesting, but nothing much. And the last interesting thing is that we don't know what happened to the original use of my conclusion is that he either got fed to the chimera after undergoing many experiments of the sanctuary he was held in. Or, yeah, it says he could be still alive with genetic renewal, but we don't know exactly what genetic renewal is. So we can just assume that he's probably dead because of the scientists there. Or if if he is alive, he might still be somewhat tortured through permanent uh, permanently experimenting on him to find a cure. Who knows? Well, that's this for this video. I hope you learned something new. See you next time. Goodbye.